everybody, hello and welcome. Today is exercise number six. And we're gonna be doing the exercise blast. But before we get started, we have to do our warm up. So let's begin with that. Our warm up begins with the good morning. So we're gonna be doing 30 seconds. Put your feet shoulder width apart. Arms are up and out. Tuck your butt in. Core is tight. And then we go all the way down arms through our legs and all the way up and press those hips forward as we breathe in and out. Okay, so we're going to do these for 30 seconds. Remember to keep the weight on your heels. You're going to slightly bend those knees. Come all the way up and breathe in and out. hips forward when you come up really stretch those arms in between your legs stretch them as through as you can okay give that a shake out we did that for 30 seconds next is the squat reach so we're going to come down and stretch down and stretch Bend those knees, stretch. This is the area you're stretching here. Reach those arms, point those toes, and really stretch out. And breathe. 30 seconds of these. Just take your time. Make sure your core is tight, your back is straight. One more. Okay, so next we're gonna go into the squat twist. So we're gonna go down and come up and open our arms, twist that body. We're gonna twist the same direction, our head and our body. Down and up. Keep your core tight, tuck that butt in, keep your back straight. Just take your time with these. We really want to get that good stretch in. We only did 30 seconds of these. Okay, here we go. So give that a shake out. So the last part of our warm up is the butt kicking jacks. So we're going to put our foot out and kick. And then when we kick, we're going to put our arms up. It's like a jumping jack, but it's just a step and a kick. Keep your core tight. Tuck that butt in. And just step and reach. Take your time. Keep your balance. The weight has to be in your heels. There we go. A few more of these. More. There we go. Okay, so we're all warmed up. So we're going to get started on the blast workout. 20 seconds of the wall climb. Opposite arms to leg. We'll reach those arms up. And really put those legs, bend them up as far as you can. Like you're climbing a wall. Opposite arms to legs. 20 seconds of these. Keep your core tight and breathe. Next, we're going to do the put our arms up, palms up, and then we're going to rotate. Now we're going to keep our body and our head facing forward. We're just twisting our torso and Breathing, keep the back tight, tuck that butt in, relax the shoulders. Just take your time with these. Three more, two, and one. Okay, now we're gonna shake that out. Just take a second, 
We're gonna do our second minute of those. Okay, remember to breathe. Legs just slightly bent. Keep looking straight ahead. And we're just twisting our torso. You can turn your hands over. And that works out a different part of your arm. Keep your face forward, your body twisting. We're just doing the last minute of these. Okay, a couple more. shake. All right, moving on. Gotta get down on the floor. And what we're gonna do, we get down on all fours, spread your fingers out, and all we're gonna do is pick our leg up, flat foot, and then put it back down, and then do the other side. Okay, so we're gonna do these for 20 seconds. Hold your cut, your core in. And then we're gonna breathe. You can just take your time with these if you find them hard. We'll only do in 20 seconds. Groiners. Okay. More. And there we go. Okay, so now we're back up on our feet. Give it a little shake. Okay, next is the hip rotations. So that's just gonna be to circle your hips. And we're gonna go in one direction for the first minute, and then in the other direction for the second minute. So here we go. I really push forward, side, and back. So really rotate those hips, loosen those hips up. direction here. Two more. And then we're going to change directions for a second minute. There we go to the other side, forward, left, back, and right. So I am going Next, we're gonna do 20 seconds of the chest squeeze march. We're just gonna put our hands up. I'm gonna squeeze our arms in, and then we're gonna work our legs as well. So, in, in, okay. Just 20 seconds of these. Try to get your arms to touch. Lift your legs as high as you can. Make things that you keep your balance. All right. Arms getting tired. Okay, so this last one is the bend over streamline rotation. So this one's a little bit complicated if you haven't done it before. Okay, stand up and you're gonna bend over at the waist. So we're gonna bend over at the waist and then go to one side to the other side, stand up and stretch, and then rotate your neck and your shoulders, arms up, go down, rotate, rotate, arms up and stretch. And then rotate your neck and your shoulders, go down, rotate, rotate, arms up, rotate your neck and your shoulders, Okay, so arms up, rotate, rotate, up, rotate your neck 
and your shoulders. Stretch it out a bit, and then we're going to do our last minute. Stand up, and you're going to bend over at the waist. And then go to one side, to the other side, stand up, and then rotate your neck and your shoulders, arms up, bend over to the left, to the right, stand up, stretch, come down, shake out your arms, shake out your neck and shoulders again, arms up, bend over to the left or right, other side, come back up, give a big stretch, arms down, shake out your neck and your arms and your shoulders. <clears throat> up, bend over, to one side reach, to the other side reach, come back up, stretch, arms down, shoulder roll, and just move your neck around a little bit, arms up, bend over, reach to the left, reach to the right, come back up, stretch, arms down, and shake it out. Whew. And there we have it. There's our blast workout. So all we have left now is the cool down. Okay, so let's start with our cool down. Hands up, we're going around the clock. We're gonna start in one direction, and we're gonna sweep down, and then up, down, and up. We come down, our knees slightly bend. We come up, stretch to the top. Hands are towards us, hands are away from us. We're just doing a stretch all the way around. Make sure you breathe. Okay, it's just 15 seconds of these. Then we're gonna change directions. Hands are out, hands are in. Nice stretch after your workout. Just gonna loosen everything up. Okay, so give that a little shake. Next is the hip circle, so we're gonna need to get down on the floor for that. 15 seconds of hip circles. Hands underneath your shoulders, fingers spread wide, and we're gonna stretch the back to the left and stretch forward to the right and stretch back. This is only for 15 seconds. Pushing it as far as we can back to the side and to the front. Fingers are spread wide so you take the weight off of your wrists. And we're just loosening up those shoulders and those hips. Okay, so now we're gonna come back into child's pose. Just take two deep breaths. And we're gonna stretch our right hand just a little bit further. Yes. Put your arm down, stretch the other one forward just a little bit more. And then bring that in and then just hold this pose for another couple of seconds. You can hold this pose for as long as you want. Okay, and we're gonna take our time getting back up on our feet. One foot, another foot, walk my hands back. And when I get up, I just give it a good shake out. And that's it for today. We've finished our cool down. So I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day. Till next time, we'll see you then.